Welcome to the channel everybody, my name is Ryan and today we are playing Graveyard Keeper and as you can see we are inside the kitchen doing a little bit of cooking here, uh, but that's it, I don't want to spend too much time inside, we've got a lot of work to do out here on our graveyard farm. Uh, so speaking of farms, it's actually going real well down here as you can see, we should probably spend a little bit of time harvesting. I still haven't mastered it yet, but I'm getting the hang of growing stuff. And we're getting some seeds back here, so that's lovely. But I don't know if it'll be... You don't seem to get, like, a good amount of seeds. I do have to make a trip occasionally and buy some more. Maybe that'll change once we start getting, like, really well-fertilized stuff. I'm not sure. But uh, here we go. Oh, my! I think my inventory. No, not quite full. Hold on. Well, what's happening here? Let's grab these. I do have a bunch of stuff, so let's put some of these away. There we go. I love how you can just work with the stuff right from the uh, trunk itself. All right, that looks good. Actually, hold on. Let me grab these and put them away. Beautiful. Also, I've been trying to um, make it a point to get these mushrooms out here every time they regrow because I do, I do like the little bit of extra energy these mushrooms give you, and it's basically a free food. You do need a lot of them though to craft it up. To craft, I think it's like five. So yeah, it's quite a bit. Quite pricey in terms of its resource count, but let's see. Let's. Oh, this must not be. Oh, it is done. Okay. This is hard to figure out where exactly to go and uh, harvest from. There we go. Drop the seeds off. Let's see how many we can replant. Now, first of all, should I? I don't know. Still quite haven't figured this out. Let's just plant it there. Beautiful. Now we can. Yeah, I guess we can go ahead and fertilize the rest of this. There we go. Oops, I don't need to select it. Do I just hit done? See, I'm not sure if it's just a one-step process or what. Oop, no. Let's see, got some more of those. Beautiful. I'm going to have to dig up some more ground, too. It turns out uh, I need a bigger farm. That's decent. Now... Here's my question. Do I need to wait for these to like get fertilized or are they just ready to go now? Because I'm ready to put the seeds in there. Let's do it. And that's it. All right, we're good. All right. Well, in the last episode, we got access to the furnace level two. Uh, looks like I need to go grab some pins, pigskin paper from the church. But other than that, we're good to go. We've got it. Let's walk by the uh, crematorium, obviously, and see. I think I've got one body in there, so we'll need to get that set up. But yeah, and if you guys missed last episode, we did get some spiritual points, and we spent some of them. I've got a couple good technologies. We're working towards embalming fluid and stuff, but we did, let's see, yeah, the cremation. We got that open, so I can probably start to work on a crematorium down there. We'll have to see. I need to pay that a visit, but... Uh, also opened up supplies for creating ink and stuff, so I need to duck down in the church and get that crafted up. Because we do have a quest for it as well, but I need it in order to write my own stories and start some better sermons and stuff. So let's see here. Oh, nope, came down here for a reason. What do we got here? I want to put this away. Oh, this goes upstairs, darn it. And I need... How many did it say? I'll just grab a few of them. That should be enough. All right, we needed two, apparently. So we've got the furnace level two. Should I destroy the other furnace that I crafted? Nah, not yet. We'll just hold on to it for now. Oh, there's a stupid tree in my way. Oh, you gotta be kidding. I guess I'll put it here. I don't really like it there, but that's okay. And what else did we pick up? I don't think there's anything newer than that. No, it doesn't appear to be, but let's go check that out. Hold on, what's in my bags? Okay. Take that pigskin back later. Let's work on this. Get it constructed. Oh boy, it's going to take a little while. And there we go. Craft it up. Let's see here. Oh, definitely want to put some fuel. Nice. Now, what do we got here? Glass conical flasks. Oh, so it looks like it does function in the same way as like the inferior forge or whatever. The furnace. Yeah, so I can probably delete one of those. That's cool, free us up a little extra space, but uh, all right, let's get some conical flask going. What do you say? And I'm gonna do a bunch of them. Actually, I guess at some point I should probably replace both of my old furnaces with these, shouldn't I? Let's see, can we just max this out? 
I wish there was a button you just click it said max anyway there we go so that's on the way that's working now we did pick uh receive another corpse while i was uh walking through so let's duck into the crematorium and bada boom there he is laying on the ground i've got one on the exam table he should oh, come on now let's oops uh let's look at this real quick because i think i did open up some stuff down here too no not yet not yet i think we're maybe we're just looking through it yeah okay so yeah i got every or the only thing i took out of this body was the meat so let me go ahead and extract the rest of these goodies all right well i've got them both autopsied and i did a pretty good job over here um i didn't mess up anything with this body the other body i did mess up some stuff but that's okay we're gonna get them both buried real quick whoops i just I always do that throw it down right before i get the exit command um now we've got ooh i think i've only got one plot here but that's no big deal we can just build a couple more but I need to take our burial certificates into town. I should probably also spend a little bit of time making up some headstones for these bad boys because I've got quite a few graves that are looking pretty poor just because all I've got is a mound of dirt, you know. Oh, come on. Inter, there we go. All right, you, you can do it. All right, well, the bodies are buried. Here we are back at the yard. We've got some of our flasks now. Oh, crap, I should have dropped off all that stuff at the church. Dang it. That's okay. I'm going to drop the meat off inside, but um, I think we'll work on some gravestones, too. So let's get the gravestones set up. Wait, am I out of stone? I swear I have some. I thought it was in the chest. Maybe I did use it for something else. Uh, apparently I did. Okay, so I might have to spend a little time walking around the farm getting some stone, too, if I want to beautify that. But... Um, let's let's actually kind of focus a little bit more on what well, the flasks and stuff so i don't remember exactly how many we needed to craft up the stations back down in the church but man this is going slow oh uh, it's a slow process well i gotta go back to the church anyway to drop some of this stuff off so let's go check it oh my god you know what i just noticed when i walked over here we're actually getting blue points from the flasks yeah, because we, when we left off the last episode, we only had 10 of them. And I've accumulated four of them now from those. There was laying on the ground right there. Magic. Oh, that's incredible. Anyway, we need to sleep. It's it's pretty close to the nighttime, so I'm going to sleep here because I've been awake for like two days straight. And I don't want to get that debuff or whatever it is telling me that I'm exhausted. So we're going to sleep here through the night. And... Great. I got to make some wood planks. I did go check to see what the requirements were. So that's why I headed back over here because now we need some wood planks. I think it was six of them. But I'm just going to polish off all the wood we've got here. Okay, well I just noticed the distinction here between the advanced conical flask and the regular ones. This is what we need actually for the building that I wanted, the alchemy workbench. So can't craft that up yet um we've got a study table already that's what this is over here so there's really no point in building a second one with those flasks but i don't know i did make a whole bunch of them Can we study anymore no um i did make a whole bunch of those flasks maybe i should go cancel that and save some of the glass for the advanced level because we can get there i just need to get some more points blue points obviously then again the blue points are what you know or the flasks are what are granting me my current blue points so maybe i should let those just run up a little bit more because i need 30 of them we're at 16 but yeah 30 would open this up and we could probably get there i guess what i'll do is i'll just let those go until we get 30 then i'll open up the advanced and cancel whatever's left oh well i just come up north to get some uh stone and stuff maybe some iron and i oops i just discovered these little jellies and they're the slimes and they're giving me green jelly which is something i've been looking for yeah that's awesome um i guess i might as well continue up here although i don't there's some stone can we get this yes that's kind of what i'm looking for now not so much the iron but uh i'll grab some iron too although i wouldn't oh that's the end of the road there unless oh we can clear this out it says no hmm there's got to be a way to do it otherwise it wouldn't be an option oh interesting i just found the uh apiary up here so i i can't do it yet i guess i'll probably need to 
craft, uh, discover, or maybe talk to somebody too. I'm not really sure, but um, that's cool. Man, there's so much in this game. I've had a few commenters say like, hey, this is great. Uh, prepare for a long playthrough though. And I think I may have underestimated just how much there is in this game, but that's fantastic. I love it. Keep me occupied for quite a while. Well, we are at 20 blue points now, so we're getting closer. Um, I've got 15, so it looks like I'll probably end up with five extras. I'll have to cancel, but that's not the end of the world. All right, good. We got a little bit of food here, which is nice, because actually this green jelly can craft up some sort of food item. I've kind of forgotten what it is, but we're going to check it out real quick. Oh, I got some beeswax, too. Dang, dang, and our chest is full. Can, can I build another one? Let's see here chest oh no this is just for decorative stuff darn it i might have to do something maybe we'll take these flowers out of here i, I i'm assuming they pro we probably don't cook with them i'll put them in the church chest but that's good yeah i'm just gonna have to start using some of this stuff man oh boy i just uh crafted up some of that green jelly and it is pretty good plus 30 to our energy or stamina or whatever you want to call it but that's huge you can see i'm making up some gravestones i think i'm actually gonna make some borders too oh i bet you i don't have the ability to do that yet man oh man tell me that takes blue points are you kidding here let's see where would i find that at oh man here it is right here stone graves fences Yes, and it does take blues, too, so can't do it just yet. We're saving that. We're saving that. That's unfortunate. What about the wood ones? Can we... Yeah, I can do wood. It must be over here. I mean, I'll put some wood in, I guess. Uh, honestly, I'm going to hold off. We're going to save the wood. Oh, here's some more flasks. Beautiful. We're getting closer. Um, but, yeah, I'm just going to go install the headstones and call it good enough for now. Because I don't want to install the wood and then uninstall them later and replace it with stone. Because I do want to do that with the existing wood fences. I think I'm going to uninstall most of these wood options here. and I'd love to see what it looks like all just complete stone. I think it's going to look really nice. But uh, anyway, let's go ahead and get these placed here. No gravestone. And yes, I know i got to go back and work on them. But let's just get them set here beautiful all right do this one got plenty of food here i'm tempted to go look for some more slime too i'm not sure where they're gonna occur at obviously in the swamps but i don't know okay let's see here one last one beautiful gorgeous gorgeous we only got a couple more days for our next sermon too so i'm really looking forward to that let's see i put these flowers away finally all right solid um hmm what can we work on next here in the churchyard? Uh, don't want to waste any stone just yet. Oh, look, here we can do this. Oh, this is for urns and stuff. Yes. Then you know what? That reminds me. Let's go down below because this is where the crematorium should be. Right over here. And I don't know. Is there anything new here? There is. Place for burning corpses. And a trunk. Well, let's do it. All right, here we go. We got the stuff. I do probably need a trunk down here, but I won't worry about that just yet. Look at that. Now, I wonder, I guess, yeah, I have to build it, but I guess, does this get destroyed after we burn it? You know, should I build another one, possibly? Uh, oh, I don't have the stuff. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I probably should. Let's see. Let's get uh, some wood down here, too. All right, now I got a few more of the ingredients here let's place the second one you can see it's pretty perfect for that so and we'll we, i won't place any more though we'll just test this out but uh that's good i don't think i'm gonna burn any bodies just yet because i don't really have a way to we don't have any urns necessarily but um we'll get there we are working towards it i just like to be prepared plus i'm just kind of killing some time till our uh blue points are done we're at 27 so i just need three more flasks Okay, guys, we finally got enough blue points for the advanced, uh, what is it, conical flasks. Here we go, glass blower too. What is this? Is this creates lens. Interesting. Okay, well, this is, we need to unlock that. Good. Now let's go in here. I get, wait, I can't cancel, can I? Shoot, there's no way. That's crazy. Well, we didn't waste that much, but that is, I'm pretty sure, all the glass I have. 
yeah so i'll need to uh go ahead and craft up some more i might have to go get some more sand and that's it though the water is super easy to come by here but let's see that is awesome we can start to work on the next stage of our glass blowing which will help open up the uh, alchemy stuff down below in the church which is great but we're also getting i'm trying to figure out what to put away here uh that's about it i'll put these flasks probably down inside the church yeah but um I think it's probably time to sleep, and we are one day away from our sermon, so I'm very excited to get some more uh, faith and study a little bit more. This is awesome. At least now we know how there's alternate ways to get blue points, too, at the furnace, and probably other crafting as well, so I'm, I'm pumped about that, man. I like how, like, initially it's, like, very hard to get them. You know, it definitely gives you something to work towards, to strive for. Let me unload some of this junk. Okay, I just cooked up some eggs here too, just trying them out, but uh, looks good. All right, let's head on out, see if our furnace is done. I definitely want to destroy this furnace too and place another one, uh, another advanced one. So let's see, what do I need for it? I have to go grab some pig skin and another complex iron part. I'll go ahead and get that crafted up while I have a little bit of energy here. Let's just let's do a few of them. Yeah, that'll give us plenty for now. All right, well, I guess there's no time to waste. Let's do our prayer here, our sermon. Um, and I can't wait to craft something better than this, too. I really need to get on top of that. But uh, let's do it. Let's see how it goes. I'm just going to speed through it. Oh, we got three already. Come on, give me some more. Give me some more. Come on, baby. Yes couple of bonuses that was gorgeous great sermon all right and you know the money is is just icing on the cake here basically well eventually i think it'll probably be a big source of income for us but right now pretty decent pretty decent what do we get here gorgeous all right let's go do some studying while i've got a little bit of energy here of course we got plenty of food so it's not the end of the world let's see here now i do need to grab I need to physically... Oh, no, I don't. That's right. I can just scroll down. I nearly forgot about that. Hold on. What else are we working on? <gasps> Feathers. I need to make the ink. What do we need? Black paint? Where the hell do I get black paint from? <laughs> um, I'm sure if I look in my technologies here, I'll find it. Let's see. It's probably... Embalming fluids? No... Theology, black paint. Oh my gosh, I don't know. It might even be under building or something. Oh, you know what? No, I bet you it's alchemy. Yeah, is there an alchemy thing? Uh, I don't know. We'll worry about it later. Let's do some crafting here. Although I definitely need to get on top of that pen and ink. Wait, am I out of science right now? Uh, let's see. What do we want to study? Let's do the skin. Oh, I have one science left. Crap. All right. I'm actually have to get on top of some science then beautiful look at that yes now how do we actually get more science i i recall getting some earlier in the playthrough but i don't remember exactly how we managed it i feel like it was a little bonus thing um i'll figure it out though all right well we're back in the yard um if memory serves correct i think we got the science from studying a book one of those old books that we picked up so i'm actually currently working on making a circular saw i decided to go ahead and open up the wooden beam and i'll tell you why because this is what will allow us to clear out some of those blockages down below um and there's a guy down there i'd like to speak to and there's probably going to be some other stuff maybe we'll get some more books or something so i'm kind of hoping that if we clear out you know what's blocked down in our bait church basement and stuff maybe we'll get some other stuff also alternatively uh now that i think about it let's pop inside real quick there might be some stuff down here let's see yeah i can clear these barrels i don't know if we'll get any books out of it but we'll definitely get oh not enough stamina <laughs> i'm gonna wait too it's almost time but yeah here you can see oh this i can actually do oh wow now i know some of them do require a beam i think this one will probably require a beam no no i just need some more iron parts awesome but yeah i have a feeling we'll probably discover some cool stuff down here I don't know if it's going to give us the science we need, but I'm hoping it does. Let me go ahead and hit the sack, though, because i got a lot of work to do in the morning.
All right. Good morning, everybody. Um, and before we go clear those blockages down below our house, let's build the circular saw. And I want to yeah, get this up and running so we can make a couple of beams because I know we're going to encounter some stuff that need beams. All right. Let's look at what else we can craft here. Oh, good. So this is like we can still do all the old stuff plus now beams. Okay. So I can probably deconstruct that other one. That's probably good enough on the beams. Let's see. Yeah, it drains the energy pretty quickly, but that's okay. That's not too bad. Okay, let's take a quick look over here. I want to make sure. Let's fill it up with some fuel. I don't have any firewood. Dang it. I sh oh, look, we can do steel. Graphite. Where the heck do we get that? <laughs> uh, we need to get these working, though. This is what I'm really here for, so... I'll start it, but, um, yeah, let me get some, oh, God, I need wood. Oh, so much I need. Hold on. Let's check my inventory. Okay, I tell you what, we've got some stuff set up to do downstairs. Maybe we'll get some wood out of that. I don't know, but look at this. Huh. Uh, do, do, do. I'm going to keep the beams on me, but let's go. let's go downstairs and see if this gets us any resources when we clear it out. He's using his pickaxe. Maybe he'll get some stone out of it. Oh boy. Nothing. <laughs> uh, what's down here? Anything interesting? Where does this go? Whoa. Oh, there's ladders here. Hold your horses. Oh. So that took us to town? Enter. Where's this one go? Looks like this one's probably right up in the tavern, I'm guessing. That's, oh, never mind. Um, that's awesome, though. So we don't have to walk. Like, if I want to go to town, I just hop down in the basement. What about over here? Why would I clear this out, though? No, I think this is probably, yeah, this one requires the beam. Yeah, one beam. Need some iron parts, though, for it. Oh, we got ourselves a corpse. See? Yeah, this is the one I really want to get unblocked. And there's a second one that allows me to access the uh, morgue all at once, too. So that's pretty critical. Let's see. What about this? Open? Looks like it needs a key to open. Well, we don't have the proper key yet, do we? All right. I think I can clear that one out if I go around to the other side. Didn't I set that one up? Or maybe I just didn't have the parts for it. I don't know. Yeah. I think I did. No, I didn't. Oh, well. anyway, so this looks good. Uh, there's a whole lot of room down here. I wonder what our basement is really going to be used for. Mainly, maybe just a lot of storage. I don't know. Anyway, let's get to work, folks. So we've got some conical flasks going here. I desperately need to get some wood, I think. Is that what we're struggling to get? Oh, also sand. So I might have to go collect a bunch more sand and wood. <laughs> oh, so many resources to get. I think we also got a notification we got another body here. Yeah, so let me slap that guy onto one of our pallets here. So much work to do. Every Whoop, get back on there. Dang it. I haven't touched either of these bodies either, so no autopsy done. I might have to construct some more pallets here. Let's see. What does that take? Gosh darn it. Uh, pop, 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 pop. Nope, need some nails. We must have ran out of almost all our parts and our nails, too. So, guys, I got a lot of stuff to make, unfortunately. But it's all going to have to wait for the next episode. We have run out of time for this one. But thank you so much for joining me. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like and subscribe for me. It really helps out. And I will see you guys on the next episode.